What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about some double XP weekends coming to Overwatch 2. Today Blizzard kind of put out a press release saying three double XP weekends are going to be held as a reward for players going through a challenging launch. Now we all know since Overwatch 2 was released there's been a lot of problems where players can't get into games, players getting kicked out of games, long queues, not being able to transfer everything over from Overwatch 1 to Overwatch 2. There's been a lot of problems, and once you get in the game, it's been really enjoyable, but getting in has been very, very difficult. So Blizzard decided to go ahead and give out these double XP weekends, as overall the three weekends will offer a total of nine full days of double XP. Now all of these weekends, start time is going to be 2 p.m. Eastern. That's going to be the start and end time. So the first weekend is going to be this coming weekend, October the 21st to October the 24th. The second weekend will be October the 28th to October the 31st. And the third weekend, Double XP will run November the 24th through November the 28th. I'm not quite sure why there's such a big gap between the first two weekends and then the last weekend being almost at the end of, or right at the end of November. But those will be three weekends that you can get Double XP from pretty much Friday until 2 p.m. Eastern on that following Monday. Now, a lot of players out there, you know, are kind of asking, you know, for Blizzard to do something since players are kind of having a hard time to get into the game having a hard time pretty much playing in general. And I think this will make some players happy having that double XP, but I'm still not sure if that's going to really make the community happy considering during these weekends, unless there is a big change considering that first double XP weekend is starting very soon at the end of this week, we may still have some big issues with the game. I know there's still a lot of players that are unable to log in, a lot of players that are still having problems with getting disconnected. I personally play on PS5, and over the last, I'm going to say three days, I really haven't had no problem whatsoever. As soon as I you know, launch the game, I'm able to get right in, have no problems with getting disconnected. I've only been disconnected, I think, once uh, that I can think of in about the last three or four days that I've played, where I got kicked pretty much right at the start of the game. So it wasn't like some players are reporting where they're getting kicked towards the end. Is this really going to be enough to make the community happy? I'm not sure. I'm not really... 100% certain that a lot of players are going to be happy with just double XP weekends considering that there still may be some connectivity issues. Hopefully they'll get the connectivity issues worked out and give us more double XP weekends down the road, you know, for uh, players in the future maybe to be able to gain some of that XP if they're still having problems trying to log in right now. But there's also some other things that I think a lot of people in the community would hope, you know, Blizzard's going to do to kind of not really compensate players, but to kind of show the community that they're grateful that they're there because there's millions and millions of players playing. They said they've broke some records over the last nine to 10 days of how many people are logging in and playing and making accounts. So I think Blizzard probably will do good by the community and maybe do a little bit something else extra down the road. We'll kind of have to wait and see. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.